After nearly a year of investigation by multiple law enforcement agencies, a Sioux City man wanted on manslaughter charges is now in custody. 24-year-old Ray Avila of Sioux City is facing charges of involuntary manslaughter and assault causing serious injury. Now, these charges filed in connection with the death of 31-year-old Peter Johnson of Sioux City. Avila was, has been on the run since shortly after 2 a.m. on July 29th of last year. That's when police say he assaulted Johnson. On Monday night, U.S. Marshals, in cooperation with Mexican authorities, apprehended Avila on the small Mexican town of Altango. A few details from the 2018 assault on historic 4th Street have ever been released by authorities. Johnson suffered a head injury in the attack and later died from his injuries. Tonight, U.S. Marshals tell us they received widespread support during the manhunt for Avila. As is typical of most fugitives, um, we uh, have a very difficult time doing our jobs without the public's assistance. And in this particular case, it was imperative that we had those tips and, uh, and it, they were extremely helpful. It took a little longer than we would have liked, um, but you know, fortunately, um, he's in custody now. Today, Avila was extradited to Houston, Texas. Woodbury County deputies will travel there and return him back to Sioux City for trial. Now, he could be sentenced to 10 years in jail if found guilty of both charges in this case.